Greeting Cyberdogs! This is Rendog coming at you from just outside Rudshaw Gate in this Let's Play Dishonored series. In the previous episode, we were about to insert this whale juice into the butthole of this machine to turn on the floodlights over here and get these walkers distracted. But you guys have told me in the comments of the previous video that that is a bad idea. So I'm just going to put this whale juice down here on the floor because what's going to happen is a whole bunch of civilians are going to get their asses murderized by these walkers. And uh, a better idea is for us going to is to try and go around the back side of this thing and uh, try to get to the Rudshaw gate without killing anybody because of course we're trying to play this game with an overall chaos level of low. So thanks to everybody who commented in the previous video and uh, told me not to insert that whale juice. Um, it looks like there may be a round, way to get around here anyway without getting our asses owned by uh, walkers. So why don't we try and do that, guys? In this episode, let's try get to that freaking gate and turn off that wall of light, which is our current objective. And um, it looks like we may be, able, yeah, it looks like we may be able to go around here, right? Because look at all these buildings and stuff; they're all busted up and broken. And uh, there might be some loot for us around here too. Oh, hello! A bread and a, and a, what is that? A rotten tibian pear. No, thank you. No, thank you. I may be hungry, but I'm not that angry. <laughs> um, so guys, it looks like we may be able to go around here. Check it out, right? Ooh, hello. Is there any loots up in here? Come on, baby. Give me the loots. No, that just goes down to the bottom where um, the only thing that we can get is our ass handed to us by a bunch of walkers. Guys, the only thing that terrifies me more than walkers in first person shooter games are the tripod things from Half-Life 2. Um, man, those things are freaking terrifying. But these walkers are pretty damn scary themselves. Man. Um, they are, you know... Oh, hello! They're, they're a really, really evil-looking um, FPS enemy. And man, they are definitely one of my favorite FPS enemies ever. Because, I mean, they truly are terrifying and really difficult to, to deal with. I mean, you have to kill three of their whale juice tanks just to take them out. And um, I don't think there's any way to take them out passively. So, hey, dude, what's cracking? Uh, I thought he was. I thought he may have been sleeping, but he's actually dead. So <laughs> something's been going on over here, man. He's been sniffing some crack or something, and he's met his demise on this filthy mattress. Uh, what a horrible way to go, man. Seriously. Um, so, oh my goodness, we are right here, guys. And look, there's the whale juice. We've got to get that whale juice out of that machine, and that it looks like that's going to disable the gate. Okay, okay, so how can we do this, guys? How can we do this without dying? Oh, Lord! Okay, stop time. That's, okay, stop time. And now let's try and blink up there if we can. Bam! No, that did not work. Bam! Extract the whale juice. Oh, my goodness gracious. The music's going crazy. These walkers are onto me, man. They can't do nothing. Oh my goodness. That was intense. Okay, but it looks like we turned off that wall of light quite nicely. And, uh, we, oh yes, baby. Old Port District outskirts. We have made our way out of there. Damn. Now, I know that we've left a rune behind. But, number one, I have no idea how to get that rune. And, number two, I'm not particularly keen to go past those walkers again. And they freaking terrify me. So let's get our asses out of here and go to the Old Port District outskirts. Oh, baby. Old Dunwall Sewer. You've escaped the flooded district and now you're winding your way back towards the Hound Pits pub. Oh, man, I can't wait to get back to the Hound Pits pub, man. I'm going to exact my revenge on those buttholes who freaking betrayed me, man. Havelock and all his butthole buddies. They are going to get it. All right, baby. There is a bone charm up in here 26 meters away. Sweet. That is, that is really close. What else is around here? Dies. Oh god! Those look like weepers to me. Yep, those are definitely weepers. Man, how are we going to get this bone shot? Where is it? Oh god, it's right in there, man! How the jazz do we get in there? That is the question. Oh God! 
there are weepers after us, man. Not cool. Oh my god! Oh my lord, there's more of them. How do we get through here? How the hell do we get in here, man? Oh, like this. <laughs> okay, excellent. Well, where is the bone charm? Oh, yeah, baby. Hello, bone charm. Blam! Blood ox heart? What the hell is that? Your max mana has been slightly increased. Now, that is what I'm talking about, baby. Um, more health, I'm good with that. Yeah, I'm good with adrenaline. Potion gives you full mana. Yeah, I'm down with that. Um, you're, you regenerate mana faster. Okay, so most of my stuff gives me mana of some kind. I think I'll get rid of the, the health. Because we've got loads of potions. And I'll activate the blood ox heart. But guys, this is crazy, man. How are we going to get back down into that pit? Um, I think I saw like a trap door or something there, right? That we got to try and um, get through. But there's a whole bunch of freaking weepers around here. I think what we're going to have to do is actually um, slow time or something like that. Oh god, they're after me again. Okay, there's the trap door. Oh my god, there are so many of them. Okay, let's slow time, baby. Open. This is not opening fast enough. No, 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 no. Get off me. Get off me. Slow time again. Oh my goodness. Oh, man. Okay, we can breathe again, man. Oh my lord, that was intense! Okay, but we've done it, and we got a bone charm, which is excellent. Ooh, hello, there's someone over here. Man, this dude does not look happy. Hey buddy, what's going on? Wish I had a last swig of whiskey. You're the mask guy's been taking down all the lords and ladies. I may be, or I might be no not, depending on who you are, key. buddy. Only one place to get that key, and I wouldn't go there. Not for all the gold in Dunwall Tower. Where? Tell me. Again. Maybe you could pull it off, though. I will pull it off, but all. Something attacked us in the distillery. It used the rats. I know it sounds crazy. And then it run back under the street. Oh god, it sounds like a monster so or something we're gonna have to, to fight. Slackjaw leading the way. It went bad. I barely crawled out. Yeah, you're not looking you know good, dude. Slackjaw. He had the sewer key, I got this, uh, this moisturizer that you might be interested in. Um, you have the face of an ass. Just say. <laughs> okay, guys. So our quest now is to get the Rats. sewer key. Rats. It looks like our buddy Slackjaw has uh, is somewhere around here. He's either going to have the sewer key, or he's going to. Oh my goodness! He's going to give us a way to get the sewer key. Um, oh god! Man, I hate those things. I'm starting to hate them like a lot i mean they do give me their balls though which is sweet and their balls do have um are worth 25 gold a piece but man they are so nasty and they keep spitting at me and they keep reminding me of little shop of horrors man and that movie kind of messed me up as a kid so every time i see those things they bring back bad freaking memories oh god all right this looks like uh perfect opportunity to throw a grenade <laughs> what the what the jazz dude man those things dealt so m oh my goodness that was that was just ridiculous all right <laughs> man that was those freaking plants just owned my ass like nobody's business um all right let's try that one more time right i mean okay oh god i missed I missed again! Man, I am a terrible aim. Give me your balls! Alright, let's try this one more time, guys, shall we? <laughs> that, was, that was absolutely terrible. Um, grenade! Finally found a use for these grenades. Die, you bastards! Wham! That is what I'm talking about. Ooh, there's another one here. Expose your squishy bits. Bam! Now give me your balls. 
man. <laughs> that sounds like a like a really bad porno or something. Expose your squishy bits now. Give me your balls. <laughs> um, oh man. There's a safe. God damn it. Can't get in there. You daft chuffer. Jelly. <laughs> Who the hell is Jelly? Here's another one for you. That old witch Granny Rags told me that you'll lose your taste for whiskey in the month of wind. Then your eyes will go dim in the month of seeds and you'll draw your last breath in the month of ice. If you want your share, you know what to do. Well, I do want my share. I want that freaking bone chop. Ooh, there's some coinage up in here. It's a random place for coins. Um, okay, so we are looking for a combination to that safe. It looks like it's got something to do with Granny Rags. I didn't know that old bat was still alive. Right. Let's carry on down here, guys. What have we got going up in this business? Oh, Lord! For sale? What, this corpse? No, thank you. Oh, God! Man, this is like uh, cutting down weeds in your garden. It's like the exterminator. Man, it's kind of like that crazy guy on Discovery Channel who deals with wasp nests and stuff. I don't know if you guys have watched that show, but he's absolutely insane. He'll like stick his hand straight into the ass of a wasp nest, get stung like a thousand times, and then crush the wasps in his fingers and stuff. Man, he is a crazy bastard. Speaking of crazy, we are swimming downwards. Man, this reminds me of the first episode of Tomb Raider. I'm sure I had to do this in Tomb Raider 1. <laughs> oh god, oxygen! Ooh! Mm, some bolts! Don't mind if I do! Alright guys, let's continue on our way up this thing. Oh god! Oxygen levels dropping! Breathe! Breathe, Corvo, breathe! Ooh! Hmm. Man, feels good to breathe again. We haven't missed anything too uh, important around here, have we? They left where it is, scattering like insects, eager to bore into the nests you made for them. Man, that girl needs to spend more time outside in the sun. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so... Oh, sweet. It looks like we're almost on our way out. Man, spring razor traps. Wish we could have used those more, to be honest. Looks like there's a way here. Oh god! Granny Rags! What the hell? What are you doing here, you old bat? And carve a pretty song on your bones. Hey! Someone kill this crazy witch! I could make you rich! Hey, that's Slackjaw! Quiet now. Granny needs to concentrate. Don't kill me. Granny Rags, stop! <laughs> Granny Rags! Can we at least talk about it? Ooh, there's some mana. My knives gotta be nice and sharp to cut into your skeleton, Slackjaw. Nice and sharp. Man, she is creepy as hell. I mean, what is she cooking on up in there? Damn, woman. Oh, God. I, so, I don't know I don't know if, if they're gonna be hostile, if I need to talk to her. Oh, God, I don't know, guys. But I, I tell you what, we're gonna do this in the next freaking episode, guys. Oh, man, this has been intense. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, guys, you know what to do. You smack that freaking like button. And uh, I cannot wait to see you in the next episode of Dishonored. This has been Rendog playing Dishonored. We'll see you in the next one, my friends. When we're going to find out exactly what the hell is going on up in here with Granny Rags and Slackjaw. Guys, I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye!